Hey guys, so <clears throat> I wanted to show you what I'm having for dinner tonight, and I wish I'd done a video, and I will do one. I can, there's not a recipe because I kind of just combined a bunch of stuff together. Well, I mean, I'll have a re re recipe on my fitness pal, um, but I have not done that yet. So, I don't know if you can see it. This is creamy cauliflower soup, and um, it is yummy. It's really cold here today. The temperature just drastically dropped. And so this morning before I left the house, I was like, you know what? I'd really love to have some potato soup. No one, I couldn't have potatoes. And I started thinking, my mind started working. And I was like, I've seen some different recipes on Pinterest. But they all had flour in them. So, um, this is, I had some riced cauliflower in the freezer. Typically, you just use a head of cauliflower, but I didn't have that. So, I used the rice. Um, I put that in a skillet with some butter, some celery, mixed it up, added some garlic, and um, then I added mushrooms. This recipe called for mushrooms. I mean, you could add any vegetable that you want. You could add carrots, or I saw one that had carrots and something else in it, but I was just trying to keep my carbs as low as possible. Um... So I cooked all that, and then I added chicken broth, um, and then I whisked that in, whisked that all together, and then I added it to the crock pot. And once it got to the crock pot, well, I actually also added xanthan gum um, as my thickener. I think it was, I, put, I think it called for three tablespoons. I added one and a half. Excuse me. Three cups of water with three chicken bouillon cubes. Um... Xanthan gum, a half a cup of heavy whipping cream. Um, yeah, so it turned out really good. And I added some cheese to it and some bacon. So I'm super excited about how it turned out. And I will try to get a recipe together because I'm sure somebody's going to ask me. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.